FTSC director Jamie Breed says the transition to include A shares in global portfolios is now beginning. And the indices are already sort of alive,、um, and we're expecting、um, our clients to start using them and actually start to transition、um, into、um, China A shares this year.、Um, so it's actually、uh, quite a big, and the market impact can actually be quite large because of the allocation that China A shares might have in, in, in our global indices. The two new emerging markets indexes include China A shares at a weighting equivalent to total RQFI allocations. And the initial weighting of China A shares in the FTSE Emerging Inclusion Indexes will be approximately five percent. This is expected to increase to thirty-two percent when China A shares are fully available to international investors. And then over time, as the market increases and the, the quota increases,、um, that would allow the weight of China A shares to increase in, in our indices and allow our clients to, to transition. To increase investors' confidence in China's capital market, Harid says the key depends on the open up of A shares allocation. And so, some of the key things that are required in order for for China to、um, open up would be to、um, open up its、um, allocation and process around the quota. Um, look at capital restrictions and capital repatriation、um, need to improve, and some some other areas such as settlement processes need to be improved in order to allow international investors、um, to have a more efficient way of accessing that market.